This is kind of where we start, and we uh, we park down here, which is almost into this little trail. So the road's there. You just drive it, drive in, and it's pretty much right here. Go over, go to your right. You can step down over there if you want to. You don't have to come out here. Look at that. That's pretty cool. Well, this is still... Oh, well, Doug, he's part Billy Goat. No, I'm not. I'm If I'd not stub my feet on stuff. Oh, that's, yeah, that'd be difficult to climb out unless you're doing some chimney climbing. What's it look like on that side? Pretty rough. Tapers out? Yeah, and we got lots of pine needles. Huh. I like the little campsite, that's cool. Man, look at that. That is some climbing right there. Well, that is way beyond my skill. Maybe when I was younger. Wow. Now that's pretty cool. Props to the guy who drilled all that in. You are a gentleman and a scholar. Looks like we had some breakage. Guess this thing broke off at one point. It's pretty cool. So this is what's on the other side. That's pretty cool. Come back up. Trail runs along the, the bluff line up there. But I thought I'd walk down here and see what this looks like. Pretty neato. So I got down here and seen this. It's like, oh man, I gotta check this out.
I'd say it probably stays pretty wet right here, being as this colored the rocks are. It's pretty neat. Gonna get dark. It's pretty neat. It smells like a cave. Somebody camped in here. Okay. How about that got smoky? Every time I come in one of these, I think now would be a bad time to have an earthquake. Alright, so we got another cave I'm going to walk up in. See what it looks like. Looks like we got crawl. Did we pass something? Are they in here? Yeah, they're on. They're all the way out. All, all the way out. The tight one. Yeah, it is. Uh oh. <laughs> I had pants when I came in here. <laughs> The mountain has given birth to yet another hiker. All right, and then another one. So I thought I'd turn it on, and see what's hear going you. on. I can see your jacket. I see a purple jacket. You could probably chimney it out, but it probably splays out <laughs> where you get yourself in a situation. Oh wow, that probably would not be good. Yeah. Hook up the rope. Yeah. <laughs> I've got something to. Uh, I think I've got all my gear. I've got it all here. I can do it, but I don't think we've got the rope long enough. What's up in there? Just rock. 
Rock? Rock. Where are you at? <laughs> I see you. I meant where are you at? Like, you're surrounded by rocks. Yeah. You're on a buff line. Of course there's rocks. Do something funny. Do something funny? Yeah. Like what? Like slip from there. Slip from here? Yeah. Get up there about another five feet and slide down. No. I don't think I will. Come on, touch the ceiling. <laughs> I ain't do, I'm not going to do it. Come on now. Well, too bad I didn't bring the right gear for that. Several inches of water. That's really cool though. That's pretty cool. That's a heck of a fire right there. That'd be awesome. So, we've hiked this rim trail all the way, and came up this, and we're fixing to go up to get to the top. So this will be pretty cool. Look at that. That is beautiful. The bad thing about using the GoPro is sometimes you forget to turn it on. <laughs> Look at what we're doing here. Well, you know, sometimes the rope just gets hung up. No big deal. Just give it a tug and more comes. Uh, since the rope was on the ground, I wasn't too worried about it being a problem. All right, there we go. Turn upside down, Ellis. Put them feet up around the rope. There you go. And look straight down. Let all let, let that top rope go. There you go. Come on down. <laughs> Spider Man, Spider Man, does whatever spider can. <laughs> kiss it? No, kiss it. 